This kid is a special bowler. This kid is a special bowler. His first wicket today, and that that ball came in, and Batson didn't play that ball at all. Poor Ashim Amla, probably misjudging the line on this occasion. Muhammad Afi was predominantly bringing the ball into the. Just around that off stump, six, eight inches outside it. The ball moved away off the seam. We'd seen him do it before. He beat Rahul Dravid on the previous occasion. This time he found the edge. And isn't he happy? Big, big breakthrough for Pakistan. Dravid gone for three. India, nine for one. Bold him. Excellent delivery. That's the line we're talking about again. Another wicket for Pakistan. What a terrific delivery. This is exactly what we're talking about. He's bowling patiently, he's bowling within himself, keeping it around that off stump and hoping that he gets some movement off the seam. Take a look at this one. Off the seam. Oh, goodness me. That was an absolutely unplayable delivery. By the time the bat came down, it had darted in and struck the stumps. What a delivery. Pat first, one fair. That is Gavin. Big wicket. I thought he got a long way forward, Aaron, but it's definitely pad first. Oh, huge blow for India. Well, it certainly was pad first, and there is the problem. Now, let's take a look whether he hit it first or not. No, he doesn't. It is going to hit middle. Well, pitched in line. Going on to hit middle, couldn't get the pad out of line. Now you got to question the wisdom of that bat and pad so close together, and the bat behind the pad. Didn't let that go. Disappointed your Raj goes for 45. India now in trouble again. 165 for six. And out. That will be the end of the innings. Well bowled, Muhammad Asif. You can stand tall here because you bowl beautifully. Picks up his fourth wicket. And his skipper gives him a huge hug. Well bowled. And they've got a lead of seven runs, India. Oh, sorry, Pakistan. Big effort from the young fast bowler. Well with Asif. In his 20th over, it's been warm conditions. Still bending his back. Zayn Khan got in two minds. Wasn't expecting the bouncer again. He's trying to sway and fend it at the same time. Gets a glove to it and a straightforward catch. And Kamran Akbal is also having a wonderful match. This man will remember this innings for a long, long time. Mohamed Asif has come of age and splendid figures. 4 for 78. Must be a happy man. Fantastic bowling, not so much this delivery as the first one. That's what caused the worries. Got the ball to swing away, and then this one just held its line. <coughs> Coming in as well, a little bit. Sehwag just not up to the task. Terrific. Unbelievable beginning for Pakistan, and this youngster has struck again. 
The dangerous Seva gone for four. India, eight for two. Oh, ball him with a brilliant delivery. He's done it again. Would you believe it? It's Mohamed Asif who knocks the middle stump over. And uh, with that middle stump, also dense Indian hooks. This kid is a special bowler. The way he's released the ball, it's snipped back again, and it's knocked him over again. Laxman's got no idea how to play him. Look how far that stumps back. It's nearly impaled Cameron Akmal. Big, huge wicket. Massive wicket. VVS Laxman goes back home. He's gone for 21. India, all sorts of trouble. 63 for three. Got him. Kept perhaps a bit low, but that's the end of Sachin Tendulkar. Well, well, well. Three top order batsmen all bowled. Mohammad Asif is on fire. Pakistan want to make a meal of it just today. Want to end it now. They're in a hurry. On the scene, didn't do very much, did keep a little low. But maybe he should have been on the front foot. We'll just take a look when we come back. But Sachin Tendulkar, gone. India in deep, deep trouble. 74 for 4, 26 for Tendulkar. What a good catch. All the work that Cameron Akmal has done pays off, as does the consistent line from this man, Mohammed Asif, who Imran Khan rates as the brightest fast bowling talent in Pakistan since Waka Yunus and Wazim Akram. This is really good cricket. Again, committing Strauss to play at the ball, enough movement, and an excellent sprawling catch. Joy on the face of Pakistan, who sent something here. Maybe it's uh, English blood. Strauss has gone for 38, it's 54 for two. What a good ball, yes, got him! First up, a Jaffa. You wouldn't be blaming Kevin Peterson, that moved so late and was the perfect length, again committing him to play. This guy can really bowl in Mohamed Asif, Pakistan have something special. This is why Inzaman wanted to bowl first. Oh, look at that. You might say that Peterson should have looked to defend, but in the end, he's undone by real skill. Plenty of pace, too. Might have bowled him, you know, on another day. What exciting moments these are for Pakistan. Nothing for Peterson, a first baller. 54 for three, England. to LBW, it is LBW. Wonderful fast bowling. We are really seeing the value of pitching the ball up. It's a lesson that anybody who can propel it quick should learn, and it's one that Mohamed Asif has learnt young. Paul Collingwood is the man who's gone now. The Pakistan huddle is the most joyous of the summer so far. That, I'm afraid, is stone dead. No argument from anybody, least of all, I suspect, Paul Collingwood. And England's dressing room is a sombre place. Conditions here ideal for bowling. Collingwood made five at 64 for four.